What's up, everybody? Happy Thanksgiving Eve. What's happening? What's going on? It's Wednesday, November 22nd. Hope all is well. I hope your day is treating you wonderfully. Welcome to my sports channel. I am the Sports Judge. If you guys follow my content, you already know how I feel about LeBron James. I mean, you know, it is what it is with me when it comes to LeBron James. Sometimes with him... It's like being in a toxic relationship, right? It could be complicated at times with LeBron James. There's times that I become very irritated with LeBron James. There's times that I blame, you know, the team's poor effort on LeBron James. But credit where credit is due, LeBron James is still putting up ridiculous numbers in his 21st season at age 38. It is simply remarkable, right? We've never seen a player play this good at his age. And Tuesday night, he led the Lakers to their third straight win with a 131-99 victory over the Utah Jazz. Like the Utah Jazz are very good. They're not a very good team. But this man is about to turn 39 in five weeks, and he's still racking, racking it up. Playing this game at such a high level. It's really, really remarkable. The new 38 is the new 28. And when you watch him take flight and or levitate, it's a blast from the past, right? It, it takes you back to his Cleveland days. I think his longevity, which is unmatched, has inspired younger players. I think his top level pl play continues to amaze us, leaving us speechless. I think his durability is immeasurable. LeBron is just unreal. He's unreal. The, the fact that LeBron James is still playing like he's in his 20s is amazing to me. It's amazing to me. And you're going to have all the haters that, that say, uh, you know, well, it, it's a different league now. No one plays defense. Let's appreciate this guy, okay? Keep going and never stop surprising us with your talent, LeBron. Keep on going. And, and, and sometimes you get on my damn nerves, okay? Sometimes you do. I will say that. Sometimes I'm, I'm ready to get rid of you and see your career come to an end, but you might be around for a, a few more years playing like this ageless wonder because of your workout routine and, and your training regimen. I appreciate LeBron been the person that he is off the floor, but I appreciate his game as well. And I know there's times I give him a hard time. A lot of that is frustration. You know, when the team lose, I point the finger at him. And you know, it's not always on him when the team lose, but I respect the hell out of his game. He takes a lot of time, obviously, off the court to fix his body, to stay in shape, a, a process that's fully engaging, for his body and mind. And I think fans underestimate how much conditioning plays into him being as good of a player as he is. This is why he's playing nearly into his, into his 40s. He's really in good shape. I don't know who his trainer or advisor is, but the rituals uh, his trainer lives by Keeps him game ready. It is mind-boggling for a player who is turning 39 years old in December to be putting up these numbers. I think the only question I have, the only question to ask now is how much longer can the four-time finals MVP keep this level of play up? I think that's everyone's question, right? I thought that this would finally be the season in which we saw a, a sharp decline in LeBron's play. If anything, he's gotten better. I mean, although it, it was due to injury, his, his decline, his decreased athleticism and overall spark in the playoffs last year led me to believe that this would be the year LeBron finally looked human, finally looked mortal, right? 
He's gotten better. His shot has improved. His scoring and playmaking have still been elite. His basketball IQ is off the charts, and he is still dominating even at age 38. I mean, it's really impressive to watch. Let's appreciate this guy while he's, while he's still around. You got a lot of LeBron haters out there. You got a lot of Bron sexuals that love him and that uh, admire his talent. Uh, but you got a lot of haters that don't appreciate this man's game. And a lot of that goes back to his Cleveland days or when he did, when he made that announcement on national TV saying where he was going to play next, that he was taking his talents uh, to Miami. You know, a, a, a lot of a lot of it has to do with that. It also has to do with his political beliefs and where he stands in, in politics and, and the comments he's made on social media standing up for... Uh, black rights and, and all that and his activism all, all, all that okay uh, let's put that aside and and look at what this man is doing on a basketball court because what he's doing again is simply amazing you know uh lebron is still playing top level basketball i mean wow my goodness and he continues to wow us each night he's a human highlight reel you see him still throwing down dunks you see him still you know driving and slashing his way through traffic, finishing strong at the basket. I, I mean, it's, it's, it's amazing. And this man is 38 years old. I think the ultimate dream for him is to be able to play with his son. Once he has that opportunity, I think he will then consider retirement. But till now, until now, I mean, he doesn't have to leave the game. He's still playing his best basketball. And I'm sitting here saying that his best Days might still be ahead of him. You know, I think the hope for the Los Angeles Lakers and being a Laker fan myself is to see them win another championship while LeBron is still around. I don't know if that's if that's likely. I don't know if that's going to happen this year. The Western Conference is, is tough. Uh, there's a lot of great teams in the Western Conference. Uh, but if Anthony Davis stays healthy, if LeBron continues to play at such a high level, and if the role players step up, and if things get going offensively, then there's a possibility that the Lakers can be one of the top teams in the West, a potential threat threat in, in, in the Western Conference, but we'll see. But man, LeBron, LeBron is playing like he hasn't aged one bit, and I feel like with age, he continues to get better. It, it, it's, it's incredible. It's incredible to watch this man continue uh, to amaze us with his phenomenal play on the hardwood floor. Thanks for watching, everyone. Really appreciate the love. I'll be back sometime today on TikTok. You guys will see some short videos from me. I most likely will get into Bill Belichick, talk about uh, the potential move to the Los Angeles Chargers. Yes, there's, there's a a possibility that he can be traded to the Los Angeles Chargers. I'll get into that a little bit and I'll, you know, probably preview some of these NFL games tomorrow, some of the Thanksgiving day games, but I'll be back very soon. Take care everyone till I see you guys. Uh, when I see you guys again, peace. And don't forget to do a huge, do me a huge favor. Hit the subscribe button. Thank y'all so much. Take care.